Hello guys. Uh, I'm back. As I promised, uh, I'm gonna make a dandelion flowers tea. So we're going to uh, my backyard. Me and my daughter. She has a plate. So we're gonna pick some uh, dandelion flowers. So, uh, you know, it's a very, very yellowish color flower. And it's a beautiful flower. So what we're gonna do, uh, we're gonna pick uh, some uh, flowers, at least to make a uh, two, three tea. So we'll see when we have the flowers. Yeah, you go. She already have uh, one flower picked. While I was talking to you guys, look at this flower. It's beautiful, isn't it? It's yellowish color. So she's gonna hold this plate and uh, we're gonna find some more flowers. Hang on. Here you go. You have one flower here. And one more flower here. So I'm gonna put that there. And uh, we'll find a few more. Here. Hey. Have another flower here. So how many flowers do we have? Um, four. Four flowers, yeah. so that's not enough. No. Here you go. It's another another flower. Pick it up. Yeah. yeah. Now we have Bring five. The plate. Oh, there's so one more. We have a few more here. One there. Now we have six. This is a big one. That's a big flower. That's a big beauty. All right, we have uh, seven flowers. We'll see whether we can find a few more or not. So we have picked a uh, few dandelion flowers here. It's beautiful yellow color. So what you need to do, you need to remove these yellow petals from the green. Simply squeeze from the bottom side. Look at that. So it comes out. You need to put that into a. I'm in a tea brewer, but I don't have a tea brewer. But I'm going to using a glass. So you need to remove this, the petals from the green, and put in a cup, or a glass, or a tea brewer. Here yeah, I already picked the uh, the flowers. I remove all the petals, some is still left. So right, and I put everything in to the cup. So what you need to do, you need to add hot water, not the boiling water. So boiling water will destroy these flowers and the benefits of it. What you need to do, uh, you need to add hot water. So I have hot water here. So I'm gonna pour some hot water into the, the cup. These flowers will make a, a one tea because now it's not uh, so many flowers. I can see it's now the water is changing the color. Slight yellowish color now. So see. My daughter is there always. She's staring with a spoon. Look at the color. It's slight it's yellowish, it's golden, the saffron color. It's beautiful, isn't it? So what you need to do, you need to keep at least this for five minutes to infuse in water. Then we'll see after five minutes how it will be. 
I just put another another same cup on top of that so it will it will infuse now so as I said look at the color it's a beautiful color so whenever you pick these flowers make sure as I mentioned in my previous video of the dandelion leaves to find the best place to pick the flowers so it's make sure it's animals away from it especially dogs and cats so try not to put the the green leaves from the flower you can see this don't put in the tea because this is bitter so this will give the bitterness to the tea, tea as well so avoid from it just use only the yellow petals so it's already two minutes now we'll see after another three minutes we'll see what will be the taste all right it's already five minutes what i'm gonna do i'm gonna strain this tea to another cup then we'll see the taste Look at the color. Beautiful color. I'm sure taste will be beautiful as well. First time I'm trying this one as well. Yeah, this also has same the benefits what leaves has. So you can drink this tea. Either you uh, you dry them and keep it in a container when you need it. You put hot water, leave five minutes, strain it, drink it. So we'll see now what will be the taste. Uh, let's give it a go. Let me try. All right. <clears throat> this doesn't have a bitterness, same like what the leaves has. This has a nice aroma when you inhale it. You get the nice aroma. It's a kind of a herbal herbal tea. Yeah, I can, I can have it all day long it's beautiful tea it's really beautiful if you want to check it in a google or youtube you can have a look uh, what are the benefits it has it as i mentioned in the previous video i'm gonna write down few and i'm gonna add it into the the video so there'll be a lot of benefits so try this make your own uh, dandelion flower tea if you if you make it just uh, post post a comment then we'll see uh, how you got through with that so I'm gonna finish this all now I'm gonna keep some for my daughter now she's gonna come and ask where's my tea so I'm gonna keep some from for her and uh, We'll see you in next video. I hope you enjoyed it. <laughs> Try yourself. Be healthy. Have this kind of tea. You don't need to have it every day. You can give it two, three times in a week. Just for a, just for a change. It, it doesn't cost anything. The flowers are free. You can pick it up from your, from your garden. And uh, you don't need to add any sugar. I didn't add any sugar in it. It's good on cold days. You know, it's refreshing tea. 
you know it will for me i feel like something new of course and i feel like uh, it's very light relax your mind you know it's kind of herbal tea so these all are always good for your health so enjoy you guys watching this video try it let me know if you have tried all right guys uh, thank you very much have a have a good uh, good good evening here actually have a good evening or good day good morning for you guys now enjoy this video thank you very much